Hello friends, welcome back. So in this session, as we said in the last session, we will try to find out the equations of the straight lines passing through a point and making an angle, a specific angle with another line. So how to find out the equation of that those straight lines? We know that to find out the equation of a straight line, we need a point and slope. We have the point here. We need either two points. It has to fit into one of the forms, whatever we know. We have a point here. The line is passing through 2 comma minus 1. Now only the problem is I don't have the slope. So let the slope be m. Now we know that this line is making an angle 45 degrees with the line 6x plus 5y minus 8 equal to 0. So we also know that the angle between two lines is given by tan theta equal to m1 minus m2 by 1 plus m1 m2 where m1 m2 are the slopes of the straight lines. Now here we have m1 equal to m2. We have to m1 equal to m. We have to find out what is m2. So for that I will just try to find out the slope of this line. 6x plus 5y minus 8 equal to 0. Can I say 5y equal to minus 6x plus 8 or y equal to minus 6 by 5 that gives me that gives me slope equal to minus 6 by 5 can I say it's slope let's say m2 equal to minus 6 by 5 and m1 is equal to m so now we can directly substitute in the formula we don't know m value but we know what is theta so let's substitute the values we know theta equal to 45 degrees because that is the angle the line is making with another line 6x plus 5 by minus 8 and m2 m is m1 m2 is minus 6 by 5 so we have everything ready so let's just try to find out the value of m for two different conditions. Remember that whenever two lines are intersecting with each other, they will have two angles between them. One will be acute angle, another will be obtuse angle because they will form a linear pair. I hope you are okay, comfortable with that. So let us substitute the values and see what we will get here. Tan 45 is equal to 1 equal to m1 that is m minus m2 that is minus of minus 6 by 5 so let me write it down minus of minus 6 by 5 divided by 1 plus m1 m2 that is 1 plus m1 is m m2 is minus 6 by 5 so if I this everything we will keep it in mod so let us check this what is this this is equal to m plus 6 by 5 divided by 1 minus 6 m by 5 let us try to if I take the mod out I will have two values two sets of values one will be plus and one will be minus so I will say either 1 equal to m plus 6 by 5 divided by 1 minus 6m by 5 that will be 1 the other one will be minus 1 equal to m plus 6 by 5 divided by 1 minus 6m by 5 so if you simplify them you will see that always you will get two slopes which are at 90 degrees which are perpendicular to each other anyway let's try to simplify this now if I do this the first one I will have 1 minus 6m by 5 equal to m plus 6 by 5 or if I simplify I will have minus 6m by 5 minus m equal to 6 by 5 minus 1 or 
it's also equal to minus 11 m by 5 equal to 6 by 5 minus 1 that is 1 by 5 or can I say m equal to minus 1 by 11 now if you check here you will get m equal to 11 but we will cross check this we will have 6 m by 5 minus 1 equal to m plus 6 by 5 so if you simplify you will have 6 m by 5 minus m equal to 1 plus 6 by 5 or m by 5 equal to 11 by 5 which gives you m equal to 11 so we have two slopes one is two we, we have found two equation two straight lines with slopes minus 1 by 11 and 11 now we can go ahead and find the equations because now we know point is 2 comma minus 1 and slopes slope is minus 1 by 11 or 11 now this becomes pretty simple point slope form so let us just try to find out that the equations of the straight lines the first one when I take m equal to 11 if I take m equal to 11 I will have y minus y1 the point is minus 2 comma 1 if I just remember let me just check that 2 comma minus 1 I should have made a mistake there 2 comma minus 1 so if you substitute y minus y1 equal to m into x minus x1 y plus 2 equal to m 11 into x minus x1 that is x minus 2 so y plus 2 equal to 11x minus 22 or can I say 11x minus y we just made a mistake here let me just fix that y plus 1 because y minus y1 this is x1 and this is y1 y plus 1 equal to 11 into x minus 2 y plus 1 equal to 11 x minus 22 11 x minus y minus 23 equal to 0 what will be the other one let us do the other one too that will be the second case we will say second case where m equal to minus 1 by 11 so how we will have the values here we will have y minus y1 equal to m into x minus x1 we know values are 2 comma minus 1 that's what we are talking about so it will become y plus 1 minus of minus 1 is plus 1 by minus 1 by 11 m is minus 1 by 11 into x minus 2 if you simplify that you will have 11 y plus 11 equal to minus x plus 2 or can I say x plus 11 y plus 9 equal to 0 so you can see two equations of straight lines we have got one is x plus 11 y plus 9 equal to 0 and another one is 11 x minus y minus 23 equal to 0 these are the two straight lines which make an angle of 45 degrees with 6 x plus 5 or minus 8 equal to 0 and also they pass through the point 2 comma minus 1 so let me just summarize how to solve this type of problems when we haven't been given the slope directly but we have been given that the line makes an angle of specific angle with a particular line so we have to find out the equations of the straight lines passing through 2 comma minus 1 and making an angle of 45 degrees with the line so we know the line let's find out what is the slope of the line that is 5y equal to minus 6 so slope equal to minus 6 by 5 let the slope of the line what we want be m we know that angle between two lines with slopes m1 and m2 is given by tan theta equal to m1 minus m2 by 1 plus m1 m2 we know theta we know m2 we have to find out m1 so we will have two criteria there one will be for plus value and one will be for negative value 
so you are taking into consideration both acute angle and also you are taking consideration obtuse angle that's why one is plus one and one is minus one you will get slopes of m equal to minus one by eleven and eleven now this is pretty simple straightforward point slope form you have the slope you have the point you can directly go ahead and substitute them and you can see that you will get two equations of straight lines one is 11x minus y minus 23 equal to 0 and the another one is x plus 11y plus 9 equal to 0 we will solve some more examples as part of this interesting concept related to how to find out the equation of the lines if i know a particular point and we know that it's making an angle, a specific angle with another line. So I'll catch you again in the next session. Thanks for your time. Bye for now.